In this interview, I invited a friend of mine to talk about time management and productivity. 만약에 이 인터뷰에서 나오는 영어 표현에 대해서 더 자세히 설명을 듣고 알고 싶으면 이 비디오 마지막에 링크가 있으니까 그것을 클릭하고 렌스를 볼수 있어요. Okay, enjoy the interview. Welcome to the Splash English Show. Uh, my name is Josh. I'm the English instructor at SplashEnglish.com. Today we are at Google Campus and I have here a friend of mine. Her name is Dunya. Hi, hi everyone. I'm a media manager at Toggle, a time tracking tool. And I work remotely and travel a lot. So productivity is a very big issue for me. That's really cool. She is a remote worker, which means she can be anywhere in the world and she can work from home. She can work from a toilet. Um, but she works for a, a, a tech company, uh, so a software company, so they, so they can do that. They can work remotely. So we call that a remote worker. So time management is our favorite topic today. So Dunya, can you tell us your uh, productivity tip? So how do you stay, you know, you have no boss, no office. How do you stay productive? How do you manage your time and how do you stay disciplined? Okay, uh, well, I do have a boss, <laughs> <laughs> but I do set my own results. And basically, um, what I do is I try to keep, I try to do like smaller amounts of time very focused. So I will do like 20 minutes of very focused time. I'll turn off everything, my phone, everything, everything, everything. And then after these 20 minutes, it's basically like Pomodoro. I'll take a longer break and try to do something else and try to clear my mind. And then also, I think everyone who wants to get more productive should kind of um, try and explore their own personality and body. Like for me, I work best in the early morning and that's when I get the most work done. But I guess everyone needs to find their own kind of routine and set it up. And as, as soon as you do, you need like maybe a few days and you'll be productive in no time. Well, cool. So first, uh, she said uh, she removes all the distraction. And number two, she does it in small chunks. And number three, you have to find your own rhythm. So she's a morning person. She gets a lot of work done in the morning. Um, I like to socialize in the morning. So what I do, I mean, we're in Korea right now. So what I do is I call my friends in New York, just like, like 7 a.m., because that's when they're awake. And uh, I usually get more of my stuff done at nighttime. Um, although I'm an early bird, I... I, I like to work at uh, late at night. Okay. Yeah. Okay. And we both love to use this software called the Toggle, T-O-G-G-L. It's a software that I just happen to use, which I use to track the, the time that I, that I spend on a specific task. So at the end of a week, I could go back and look at this uh, graph and see, okay, today I worked on English lessons for, uh, you know, five hours. So it kind of helps me I keep track of where I am in, in my time. So do you use Toggle too? Yes, I love Toggle actually. Um, well, I work at Toggle, so oh. this is like a <laughs> disclaimer. No, but we don't have to use Toggle at Toggle, mm -hmm. but I do use it. And what I love about it is it really kind of, it helps me keep my focus. Because when you know your timer is on, you really don't want to do anything else. You kind of feel guilty. So I think time tracking really holds you accountable. So even if, like, it doesn't matter what tool it is or what do you use, the moment you start controlling things, you, <clears throat> you kind of, you're, you, ho you hold yourself accountable. Right. I mean, you don't have to use Toggle. You could use a stopwatch and, and put in an Excel sheet. I used to do that. Um, but there are tons of software out there that will help managing time easier for you. So you can track and you can look at the graph. Okay, um, before we leave, I just want to go through a quick uh, a lightning round of questions. Okay. What is your favorite f Korean food? Uh, bibimbap. <laughs> that is such a cop-out <laughs> answer. Was, is it? <laughs> I don't know. I also like samgyetang. Okay. Oh, okay, samgyetang. <laughs> um, favorite place in Korea to hang out? Mm, uh, Songsu. Around uh, Songsu Station. Uh huh. Yeah. Um, it's like an up and coming neighborhood now, so it has a bunch of nice cafes. I go there and work and walk around. It's like, it's still up and coming, but it's still really nice, and there's a few nice places. Okay, great. Just a general impression about Korea, Korea and Korean people. I love it. <laughs> I love it. That I is don't. the correct answer. <laughs> He told me to say it. <laughs> no, I, I don't want to. <laughs> I don't want to. I don't want to leave Korea, mm -hmm. but there's something about Korea that just makes me want to stay. 
Okay, last question.、Uh, your next travel destination. Uh, well, first I'm going home to Serbia for about a month, and、uh, I'll be traveling around Europe for a bit. But then I'm coming back to Asia, going to Thailand, and I'm kicking off my travels in Southeast Asia, hopefully. Wonderful. Well, thank you so much for coming、thank、on the show today. Okay, everybody, be productive, manage your time well, and discipline yourself, and study English. Did you enjoy the show? 만약에이인터뷰에서나오는영어표현에대해서더설명을듣고알고싶으면이링크를클릭하고레슨동영상을보십시오